Hello everyone, welcome to Kill the Cast. This is our first episode in our The Real Ghostbusters uh, cartoon Patreon commentary thing of a thing. My name is Jerry. As always, I am joined by Jay. Who are you going to call? Us, Kill the Cast, to do commentary on some of your favorite childhood cartoons. Exactly. And uh, the man who is the one who, who wanted to do this, who put out the original idea for it, Kenneth. Ah, <laughs> yeah. So, with that being said, uh, we're going to be doing episode one here, and it's going to go out to everyone, and then episode two will actually be Patreon exclusive, and going forward, they will be Patreon exclusive. They will be available to anyone who is at the $6 and up tier. So, not too bad. You'll get these commentaries uh, each time. So, with that being said... You will be seeing a video one, so this part doesn't matter to you. But for us, we've got to line it up. So I'm going to say three, two, one, play. And at play, we will click play. Are you ready, my dudes? Yes. I'm assuming that's a yes from you too, Kenneth. Huh? Huh? Poke, yep. Poke three. All right. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> three, two, one, play. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You know, I've never seen them bust this ghost ever. Do you think Akira Tomiyata got the idea for Fat Boo from this guy right now here? <laughs> no, actually, he got it from uh, one of his uh, producers. Oh, well, then his producer got it from here. Jimmy no, I mean, he still designed... Hot, even as a cartoon. Oh, yeah. I think oh, yeah. daughter is a cartoon. Hot. Uh, I won't lie, I've definitely spanked it to some animated Ghostbusters porn. I... I'm with you, man. I have not, but I, I never assumed that there was any, but I guess Rule 34, that bitch. Um, one of my favorite things about cartoons from this era is the animation quality of the opening always has a little bit more than the actual cartoon. And so, like, this show, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Thundercats, all the openings, the animation is, like, so badass to get you hyped, and then it's never anything like that in the actual show. That's true. It don't matter. It's still good. awesome. So, y'all know why this is called the real Ghostbusters and not just the Ghostbusters? Because of the other Ghostbusters cartoon. Yep, there was another one that involved, like... With the monkey! <laughs> yeah. Some... Oh, here we go. Somebody seen a ghost? Hey, Uncle Joey! Hey, Garfield! All right. I like how Slimer became a mascot. Yeah, he's like barely in the first one. Well, I mean, not barely. Hey, look, you know it's what I mean. Kenneth like, on prom night. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Peter, would you look at some point in the series, they tell the story of Slimer. Ouch! 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 What is that? He's eating it, so it's got his food, right? Was it chocolate, like chocolate, chocolate cookies. Oh, I'm down. I will, I will Oreo. I will fuck up some Oreo like I was slime. Multiple entities. This could be. I had that toy as a kid. Looks. Me thing. too. I have so many of these toys. The uh, comic book store down the road from me, not too long ago, had like the bat pack and the the gun from the toy set, the like bluish purple and orange gun. <laughs> And yeah, see, I had, the, I had the proton pack and I had the trap. <laughs> I had the proton pack, I had the trap, I had the PKE meter, I had the the house, I had the car, I had a couple action figures. Jay is actually still in the traps nowadays, it's just not a toy. Possibly New Jersey. Possibly hmm. Almost no intellect reading. Egon, Ray, excuse me, but can we move this gig along before all this chocolate makes me break out? Marnold's! Why, I, I they dumb looking. <laughs> all right, they all three just have gigantic lips. <laughs> also, I'm not sure why one's wearing a diaper and the other ones are wearing no clothes whatsoever. I don't know. Maybe because they know how to hold it? That's a child, that's why. The rest of them are potty trained. Hey. Wow. If a ghost can take physical form and it poops on the floor, will you slip in ghost poop? Yes. Okay, okay, we know and then Egon there. will want so a sample of it. Pooptoplasm. Speaking of pooptoplasm, that answers your question. question. Oh, oh man, Winston, Ghostbusters the scat cartoon. This. this turned really sexual. 
Opening the trap now. I like how the cartoon just starts out with assuming you've seen the movies, you know who they are. It's just another day for the Ghostbusters. Yeah, no character there's, build up. Anything. There's an episode somewhere in the series that takes place the day after the first movie ended. Oh, really? Yeah. That'd be cool to watch. That would be I dope. can't remember which episode right. it is, but it does. Check. I gotta say, clean. I like well, Egon's uh, yes, hair, and, and I also no. like that his hair reminds me of a funnel cake. <laughs> a cannoli. A cannoli. Gentlemen, I'm the owner of this plant, and I can't thank you enough. True, true. <laughs> but as a token of my appreciation, true, definitely, you definitely can't thank us enough. That's it's ironic that the voice of, of Garfield played Vankman in oh, this, yeah. and then Bill is. Murray played the voice of Garfield in the yeah. Garfield movie. And you know what's funny? I actually read a, uh, a thing that said Bill Murray was not happy about the fact that they had the guy who plays Garfield doing his voice. Hi, That's Andy. why, like, later on in the series, he gets recast. And has the most beautiful secretary in Which the one world? is Uncle Joey? We brought you a little oh. surprise. No, he does one of the voices. Uh, guys, how sweet. I'm not sure. I'm going to look right. it up really quick. I know what one of them is Joey. What's hey, what's it? Guess she's allergic to chocolate. See. No, they're empty. No, she's definitely not empty. allergic to not... Except <laughs> what? God. You can yeah. fuck Egon's hair. <laughs> Slimer! Yeah, yeah. Fucking Slimer. <laughs> He's just a pet now. Yeah. They captured him in the first movie, yeah. and then he's just a pet. I want you to yeah, know, I had an Jay. action figure of him, too. Jay, you're Stand the Slimer back. of Kill the Cast. Him. This whoa, time whoa, whoa, really whoa, gonna... whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, Peter, take it easy. I'll just... I'm the Peter. Slimer. For you're sure. the Peter? Slimer. Yeah, You've or the Egon, one of the two. Naughty ghost. I naughty, I... naughty. Come on, Ray. I think it's you're the one with red hair, is all I'm gonna say. One more mess up, Slimer. I don't have red hair. You got that? I'll take Dan Aykroyd, though. I'll be Dan Aykroyd. I was thinking more of like... I was thinking more of like... Oh, you guys are not fucking me, by the way. piece of cake. What are you talking about? We do on a, on a multiple monthly basis. Dr. Peter Bankman. It was a figure so, of speech, Slimer, okay? Uncle Joey... In is. season yeah, one or there, throughout the whole thing? Soon as I dump oh, these questions. Because there's two different cool guys storage. who do his voice. Welcome to our Good 220 question. volt. It's crazy the 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 Magnum? containment unit in this. But it tells the story of that too. Like everything gets covered of why of the the differences between the movie and this. It all gets covered. Why the containment unit is huge in this one, in the cartoon everything. Arsenio Hall is Winston. That's fucking awesome. Hell yeah. I also find it amusing that Ray's uh, Ray is sleeping right there with a Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, and he was the one that thought of the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man that made uh, Gozer turn into him in the movie. Way to go. Huh? Oh, you're talking about Frank Welker. Okay, yeah. hold on. So, I gotta say, food in cartoons looks no, so good. No, so Uncle Joey is Peter. Right? Frank hmm. Garfield is Ray. Hello? Yo, anybody down there? <laughs> Funny, I could have swore I heard somebody. <laughs> I can't ever think of Arsenio without thinking about that episode where Kane Hodder went on there dressed up as Jason. Yeah, that was hilarious. That's so good. So actually, so yes, the guy that does Garfield does the voice for Ray, and that same person is also Megatron, the original cartoon Megatron. in your history. Wait a minute, that can't be right. That's, I'm looking at IMDb right now. Because Bankman sounds just like Garfield. Yeah. Maybe he took, a, maybe he did both and then he took over, but it's, um... Oh yeah, okay, so it says Uncle Joey took over in 87. 
I don't know. It's hard with cartoons because it's not just a single thing. You, and I don't like waiting. <laughs> well, there you go. That's how ghosts get skinny. I told you to put him on a diet. I did. But he I can't tell if she looks like intestines head. or like her I'm head is like a softer. <laughs> You I'm thinking more like lots of strawberry ice cream. And comb your hair, it's a mess. Oh, yeah, it's, it's all deformed. It's, it's a mess, Pa. Now, what are we gonna do, dear? How do those two ghosts give birth to that? That doesn't make any sense. Right out of there's a lot of shit about this show that doesn't make sense, but there's also some really creepy shit in this show. Uh, my favorite episode is probably the Boogeyman yeah. episode. Right? That was a creepy fucking episode, dude. And the Sandman, that one was creepy too. My Oops. favorite episode I watched all the time now, as a kid is the one where they have the baseball game. Aww. Right. That I know which one you're talking fantastic. about. Where they're trying to save one of them soul. I think Winston's soul. It's been so long since I've seen it. I'm going to have to find out which episode it is. No, it took a twist at the end of it. They thought they were fighting, they were uh, playing for Winston's soul. They were actually playing for somebody else's. For one of the other guys. Have no fear, Dr. Vinkman and his staff are here. Everything is under control. It sure is. Thanks to these two wonderful people. Hey, we've got the ugly beast right in here. What's up with the pencil thin mustache becoming like a thing for bad guys? You'll be hearing a lot more from us. Better luck next Good time. Question. It was like that in Looney Tunes cartoons too. Yeah, like you always see the pencil thin mustache on bad guys. But like, if it goes boo, has it always been like that, or is that like no, a new thing? This is the real or not like a new new thing, but not ghosts are us. Never mind. I wonder hey, if that real Ghostbusters line Ghost right there was a anyway. slight towards the other show. I have 20 cars for them today. No, probably. That's what we'd like to know. Because the ghosts are faking. I, I, I doubt that's what they had in mind when they did that. Those guys are definitely you don't think they'd be bogus. petty? I think I'd Not be according petty. to my PK leader, Peter. I'm not, I'm not saying it's outside the realm of possibility. I'm just saying that specific line was in relation to the ghosts pretending to be Ghostbusters. I know there was some bullshit involved. I just can't remember. Right. Gotcha. All right, I wish you'd get me. Small Dwarf Hotel, major disturbance. Let's Small roll. Dwarf Hotel, not this the Waldorf Hotel. The yeah. Ghostbusters. See, Jake, he looks just like you. Which one? Right. I don't. He doesn't have a glorious beard. This looks bad. Well, I mean, yeah, he's shaved, but still. And now I have that thought. They also don't look anything like the cartoon characters. Or they're the actors. That's what I meant to say. How can you not tell that these two guys are not human? I don't know. Like, she has a, a neck the size of a giraffe. And his skin is gray. I want to know how the Ghostbusters don't recognize it. Especially that right there, yeah, like the ghost yeah. popped up. Those guys. Something very ugly about them too. Whoever they like, are, even they're Egon putting us be like... right out of business. Hee 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 hee. see those dumb ghosts? I like how their containment system is just a trash can. <laughs> That stupid tan, Daddy. How much longer do, do we have to do this? One last time, Zonk. Then the Ghostbusters will be history. <laughs> what makes you think that so it three takes four miss? It takes yeah. I was gonna say it takes three miss jobs for them to be out of business. Spook, yeah. Card, like I don't know. Go ahead, Janine. There's something freaky going on here. What's wrong? This oh, one should go three ghost short. Yeah, for real. Impossible. Nothing can escape that system unless it's shut down. Hey, wait a minute. That's like that who one those time. ghosts or us goons look like. That bear the camp? Class fives we yeah. this one time Do when uh, right, the EPA shut down like the containment unit. But how did they escape? Oh, no. This man has no dick. Somebody must have <laughs> shut down the containment <laughs> unit. Is this true? Oh, it's true. Slimer. Excuse See, me, Mr. Pecker. Oh. Hold on. 
Slimer yeah, you should have blasted right, Slimer right in the face. Ghostbusters. He did blast Slimer. Blast Stay Janine closer. right in the face. Help oh, is on the way. As long as she keeps the those glasses on. Yeah, I got better the the uh, crick, Well, with all my pins up aggression, she made them on. Oh wow. <laughs> that happened. Knowing them, they're probably already there. Then let's go and bag those turkey. They're coming. They're bag coming. Turkey. They're coming. They're I speak Josh. Coming. Exactly. Oh. They're coming. <laughs> like, why did you I have to destroy it. the phone booth? You're a ghost. You can literally just walk through it. They were coming. Yeah, I <laughs> With their child that, right there. Oh, God. Is this a survey film, too? Look who's <laughs> What are we doing here again, Pop? Recording a Serbian film, too. Yeah, Turlock's in there. <laughs> He's the Class 7 Phantom who haunts this dump. Class 7? Oh, well, that's a lot. They're <laughs> Class 5. <laughs> I like class seven. I like oh, that the oh, ghosts right. know the class that's system that you got invented. Those Ghostbusters run for the next Well, maybe he got it, uh, you Watch know, this. from one of those books. Look, that the ghost wrote. Book of the Gozer. Tobin Spirit Guide. Hey, Tobin hey, Spirit hey, Guide? Hey, there you go. Hey, I've had a Tober loan or two. Come on, two now. Come on, in my we need you to do a first-rate haunting for us! A new ghost has set up residence. It's not Turlock. Uh, uh, that's great, Turlock, but we're not ready yet. <laughs> that also on, sounds Turlock, like Kenneth when he ejaculates. <laughs> Occasionally. Oh, wait a minute. Where's Turlock? <laughs> Only you. I mean, and you have disturbed me. I gotta say, the voice for this creature is kind of scary. Oh yeah, it's dope. That's a that's a super creepy voice. I love it. When I went through that, also, band... it wasn't so comical. That would be an awesome design too. You know, when I went through that binge of watching this show, I'm telling you, man, the further, if we continue this, the further we get into it, there's some really creepy shit in the show. You know, I've seen hentai. I think I know what's going to happen. Unfortunately, it doesn't. This is also reminiscent of uh, Akira. <laughs> Oops. Well, what do you know? For a change, we're actually the first ones here. <laughs> oh. Like that the second one's here. Man, well, those axles are going to be expensive to replace. Would you I'd say so. Fun? That's at least a class 8 free roaming vapor. Worse, a full magnitude class 10. Whatever it is, yeah. about to match Manhattan <laughs> in the cheese spread. Also, that's clearly not a free roaming base. It's a solid okay, object. Boys, round up time. Well, maybe it meant right free roaming as uh, wherever it may roam. You got it. As in, or it goes where it wants. Is home. Yeah, like Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, like a lizard hat. Check. Wait, what'd you say? Switching on power. What? I said Grand Theft Auto. Ready for no, launch. not you. All Him right. before you. Let's kick some ectoplasm. All clear I behind. Said wherever lays Prepare his head is home. Launch. Oh, launch. I thought you said something about lizards. What? I, I don't know. Hey, Egon. Ever gotten around to taking those flying lessons? And they say cartoons no. aren't made to sell toys. Just checking. Who said that? Hey, I was just fixing to say I love how every one of these shows that came out around that time period, all the superheroes have flying stuff. Oh, yeah, dude. I like, dude, I like uh, the Ninja Turtles. Like, they have vehicles. Is that fucking yeah. Joe Camel driving the taxi? Uh, no. It's like, did you have the turtle wimp toy? Look at that face. That is Joe fucking Camel. Well, that's a human, not a camel. Oh, my word. And I think the it's racist that you would assume that it's Joe. <laughs> How dare you imply that he is African? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I had those glasses too. Now I'm getting readings from those class fives up ahead. Perhaps we can contain them there. Check. 
Who cares about the class five? You got a class ten. But traffic's killing us. Hang on, Winston. I know a shortcut. Why is Winston always the one cutting, caught in traffic? Uh, Ecto one, Ecto two. We're on our way. Roger. We'll block the far end of the bridge. Do y'all think y'all are good enough drivers to actually ride on the rail? Yes. I love how movies like this and cartoons, the they don't focus on all the dead people. Psychic energy is increasing. Yeah, it's like a Godzilla movie. In four seconds. Right. But in, seconds, in the back of my head, I'm always seconds, thinking about, there are a lot second, of squished folks on that bridge. Here they come. Woo! Well, that would be easy. Man, all the destruction. Who pays that They're bill? In. All by themselves. Guys, go. But it's I, guess I didn't know that ghosts could fucking squish you like that, man. I figured they'd just go right through it. Except for that one, obviously. I guess you can choose as a ghost. impregnated toys, you know? Hang on, guys. We're almost there. Was he crying? Look like Oh, home in my jam. Like gleam in his eyes. Which eye? He has four. But for real though, like, would your car insurance cover that, or would they call that like an act of God? Don't know. Well, my car insurance covers acts of God. Oh, does it? Yeah. Okay. What about acts of the devil? Whoa. I guess that'd be debatable. I mean. Fucking spiritual what entity, me? spiritual Same entity, I suppose. Me. Sorry, Chris, we can't Aim cover your monkey. car. We don't cover ghosts, and there's no uh, proof there are ghosts. Motherfucker, there are recordings of it destroying my car. Anyone could Photoshop that nowadays, Bring Mr. Kenneth. <laughs> well, I bet Ed and Lorraine Warren would have picked it. I don't know how, how, you know, that's where after the Conjuring movies, they might be like, oh no, they embellish all that shit to sell movies. They definitely embellish. Dude, I'll be honest with you, I've read a couple of those two books, and I'm like, I don't understand how anybody can take them seriously. Okay. Man, it's okay. Makes for good movies. What is Slimer afraid of? What's it take to stop One, this why guy? is he falling? He, can, he literally two, floats. We can't stop it. <laughs> It's like oh, Daffy Duck in the Looney Tunes cartoons, man. He falls off the fucking side of a cliff. He's a duck. Up, we'd be home in our jammies right he can now. fly. Oh, that's the... We need to do a commentary to Daffy Duck. Slimer. Yeah, right? Slimer. There's actually Don't one of the cartoons where uh, Bugs Bunny's looking at him. He's like, I wonder if that silly duck will remember that he can fly. And then <laughs> Daffy hits the ground right. and he's I'm like, I guess not. Overload. No. Why is that a feature that you built into your fucking machine? For this particular instance. <laughs> He's Egon, he thinks of everything. Kablamo! It's a Thorlack! Why do I suddenly want sushi? Five seconds this the is not the time terminal. to think about vagina. Okay. <laughs> so, okay, what kind of explosion was that exactly? As it didn't destroy the bridge, <laughs> but it did affect the psychic water. energy plasm. <laughs> Slimer, I hate to say it, but you look marvelous. <laughs> All right, would you get a blowjob from Slimer? That's some yaoi shit right there. I think it would definitely be an interesting experience. Well, ask fucking uh, Ray. He got the ghost blowjob in the first movie. Shut up. Yeah, but I mean specifically like full on from Slimer. No, I no. I just stick my dick in his back. I figure it'll all be the same. Just pick a spot and stick a dick in it. Fair enough. Well, that's what you get on our commentaries. Where do you put the dick in when it comes to spiritual entities? And with that being said, we're getting out of here, guys. Thanks for joining us. 
Uh, we will have more coming. That'll be on the Patreon. So check us out. Come back and get your feeling a dick. And we will see you on the next fucking episode. Deek. <laughs>